Hey guys, hey, this is Nay. Follow me on IG, Periscope, Twitter, Spreaker, and support me on Patreon and Nay Rob on YouTube. Don't forget to like this video, share this video, comment respectfully, and subscribe. Now, let's talk about if it really works. Okay guys, I'm going to be talking about the Collagen X. The original 24 karat gold collagen mask treatment. I got it from TJ Maxx for about $9.99. And it says what it does is it diminishes fine lines and wrinkles by 25 to 75% even after one use. High performance moisturizer and hydration you can see and feel up to 24 hours. Reduces dark circles and puffiness. Firmer, more taut skin, easy and convenient to use anywhere for all skin types. Okay, so first thing that I did was I got me some regular cleansing cream, Noxzema, but I'm happy to use the dollar store brand too. It works the same way and I clean my face the way I normally would. And I know you're like, nay, I can't see you. It's okay, I'm going to bend down and look at the camera and you're going to see me, right? But um, it's... I just rub it in normally the way I would and y'all know normally I use baking soda but I didn't use baking soda this time because I didn't know how this blicker was going to work so I just went on and just used plain Noxzema in this and um, after that what I did was I just rinsed it off the same way I would with anything else. So um, as I'm wiping off my face I need you all to pay attention to under my eyes. You can see that I have these bags under my eyes. I've, that's always been a concern to me, and it's always this worst um, around allergy season. Down here in Atlanta, I mean, the pollen is vicious down here. Do you hear me? I mean, vicious. So it seemed like my the puffiness and dark circles around my eyes has gotten bad sooner. But at any rate, I'm wiping everything off um, so I can go to the next step. So here's the box again. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of nervous because I have very sensitive skin, but I've heard that products with like the gold in them work very, very well. So that's what I would encourage me to um, try the product. And plus right about now, before I jump into some plastic surgeon chair, I said, let me go ahead and get me some old I don't know facial mask stuff and see if that mess works okay so now here we are here's the mask um I don't quite understand it because uh, I'm like well it doesn't look right and then why is it so goddamn wet on the inside what the hell is going on here but hey here we go I'm looking at it all crazy like what no Mickey Mouse juice is this, child. So, I'm opening it and I'm like, why is it so wet? Like, ugh, why? This is gross. Ugh, and, it's, and then it was like everywhere, guys. Like, okay, so, you see all that? I'm like, what the hell? Is that going on? And is this shit going to go on my face? I'm like, oh my God. So now I'm trying to figure it out. I'm trying to open it up. And there it is. I'm trying to show you everything. Look like, you know, the happy face from the t-shirt. So now, I'm opening and I'm still trying to figure it out. Okay, boom, there you go. Open it up. And then here where the, here's, here's almost to the point where we had problems, okay? So here we go. This is the mask. It feels like it's falling apart in my hands. I can't control it. It's slipping through my hand like I have an eel or a live fish in my hand and I can't do it. And then bam, now I'm putting it on my face. Here we are. And I'm like, okay, so I can't put my head forward because it's going to slide off. And I'm calling for my wife to be like, wife, help, because now I got all this goopy stuff like in my eyes. Now it didn't sting. The goopy stuff that was in the bag, it did not sting, I'm not going to lie. But they should have told me off the break that I needed somebody to 
help me with this or even lay down or something. But I can't see. I can't put my face down because it's going to slide so, off my face. Okay, so now it's on my face, but I still can't put my face down. So I can lay down so it can stay on my face. So I'm like trying to figure it out. What the hell am I going to do so I can get out here because I can't open my eyes because like I said, it's all this goopy shit in my eyes. And I'm like, what the hell am I supposed to do? You know, I'm about to waste my money on this. So child, that's when I started hollering for my wife. Wife, wife, come get me. Come help me, please. Okay, so it does recommend that you are sitting down or laying down or something. But they needed to tell you that you need to be lying down and apply it while you're lying down. That's what they need to do. You know, but even still, I can still feel it like shifting on me because it took a while before it even like dried up to a point where it wouldn't move but it still didn't like get hard or um like a normal mask would get hard it just felt the, the goopy stuff it was just a little stickier that's all so it wasn't as much movement once you got to the 25 minute 30 minute uh, mark but I'm going to tell you, I was very impressed by the results. So um, when I saw the box and I seen the picture on the box, I actually assumed that there would be some kind of creamy packet that I would apply to my face and it would look like the picture on the box. Like I thought it was going to be some gold junk that was going to be in the packet that I was going to squeeze out and apply it on, but that wasn't what was happening. You saw what was inside of the packet, like this gold poly urethene, silicone ish, plastic ish type thing, along with some goopy stuff. Okay. Whatever the magic is, goopy stuff, magic goopy stuff is, that was what was in the packet. So I guess it was a combination of that goopy stuff being on your face because the mask is actually drenched drenched in it and you like I guess sealing it in your face with the mask somehow I, I don't know but it's not what you think it is it's not a, a gold cream it's goopy stuff in that gold mask so um what i didn't jive with was the fact that they was like just leave the goopy stuff on your face you don't have to do nothing but just like rub it in i was like rub it in i don't know this goopy stuff like that but i went on and did uh what they told me to do and i was very impressed because my puff eye puffiness was just about gone i mean it was gone okay so i just took the mask off um i see the results like it worked with my puffiness because y'all know my allergies be off the chain and i'll be looking like a battered frog but i see it the puffiness is gone yeah it really yeah and um yeah, I can see the difference. So, I also have the 24 karat gold thingamabobs that go under your eye. And I'm going to give you a review on that one, too. So, overall, the product, the Collagen X, the original 24 karat gold collagen mask treatment. It comes three masks in a packet. And, again, I got it from TJ Maxx for $9.99. Um, they say to use it twice weekly but uh, I don't know if I need that much because my skin is overly sensitive I could use it probably once a week and it'll be fine but um it's highly recommended guys I I love it you know I mean I to be honest I've used quite a few things for under eye puffiness and um the only thing that has worked is this product that I was using from Estee Lauder and this okay guys so if you all have been following me from the very beginning here on youtube you all know that i have just celebrated my two-year anniversary here as a creator right i think i started in 2012 yeah i started as 2012 as just a subscriber and then two years ago in 2016, February 2016, I um, 
became a creator and I have not shot to the moon, but I think I have pretty decent momentum here on um, YouTube, which is very tough to do. I guess you all find me interesting. Y'all know that I am um, retired now, or at least I won't be working full time for anybody else other than myself again. And um, you all, my dedicated subscribers, watching my videos all the way through, not skipping through the um, commercials, you know, sending me words of encouragement, telling me how much my commentary helps you to get through your day. Um, that is all part of the reason why I'm able to be in the position that I am in now. And I would love to thank each and every last one of you all if i could touch each one of you all's hand even the haters that just come here just particularly to just hit the um unlike button which them dumb dumbs don't even know that even when you come on and hit the damn unlike button you still pushing my video to the top with the ratings whether you give it good or bad but child that's enough i swear you say something against their favorite star child and they never let it go. They remember you forever. Do a video to piss one of them daggone stalkers or stands out. They will hit that unlike button on you like, bam, quick, fast, in a hurry. And you could be talking about Jesus. You hear me? Jesus. And then mother suckers will hit the unlike button on you. But hey, anyway, guys, don't forget to like this video, share this video, comment respectfully, and subscribe. Follow me on IG, Periscope, Twitter, Spreaker. And support me on Patreon and Nabob on YouTube. Now, remember this. The same people you meet on the way up will always be the same people you meet on the way down. Naysayers, my patron loves. Have a good one. Deuce.